Hey, plant gang, let's talk about another Ilex. This is Ilex vomitoria, uh, the Yopon holly. Uh, this is a North American native holly, actually extending from the southeast all the way down into parts of Mexico. Uh, a kind of popular, some popular versions. Uh, I don't see this full-size one as much on the market as I do. There's a pendulous or a weeping variety of Ilex vomitoria that's quite popular as well. Uh, but I love, 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 love uh, the, the fruit that ends up being on this plant, uh, but also the, the soft gray nature of the stems are quite beautiful. The small texture of this leaf that it can bring to the garden. A, a great medium to large size shrub uh, for the landscape uh, that really does uh, give good texture and good appeal to the home landscape. Again, Ilex vomitoria, the Yopon holly. This is a broad-leafed evergreen, just like all hollies in the Aquafoliaceae family. Uh, again, native to southeastern United States, down into Mexico. Hardy from zones seven through nine. Can get about 20 foot high, maybe a little bit higher, uh, spreading out to about 12 foot wide. Uh, the specimen I'm looking at right now has been limbed up, uh, but this would be a, a plant that cascades all the way down to the ground, that branches all the way down to the ground, uh, left unpruned, but you can prune it up if that suits your gardening needs and what you need in your home garden. I think it's very suitable for a screening plant. It's a great uh, plant size uh, for screening in the home garden. So very small round fruit uh, that will cover this and light up this plant in uh, the winter time. Uh, right now we're looking at it in August, the fruit is still green. Here is a landscape tip. Very popular in the deep south where it is often used as hedge screen or windbreak or even a topiary.